Hidden places like Sheep Falls take on a completely different appearance draped in white. It's an appealing side trip for snowmobilers from eastern Idaho. The falls are only a few miles off the main winter route into the Cascade Corner, the groomed Cave Falls Road. This group of local riders, known as the Moody Powder Pushers, is headed toward a slice of Yellowstone National Park. Their ultimate destination is an ice-encrusted Cave Falls. Cave Falls actually lands inside of Yellowstone Park. We can access that through the Ashton area. There's some beautiful scenery in there, and it's close and it's convenient. It's a very beautiful ride, and it gets very little traffic because it's virtually unknown. It's one of those hidden treasures. And that's the other neat thing about Southeast Idaho. You come in, we've got some neat sites to be able to ride into, and you're close. You know, being able to live on this side of the state's a privilege. During the winter, you see water and icicles and that kind of stuff you don't see any other time of the year. Cruising over the snow-packed road, the group reaches a small corner of Yellowstone Park. The rider's final destination is just around the bend. The neatest thing about that place to snowmobile is there's a destination. And so uh, at the end, you sort of get a treat for uh, going in on that, in, on that trail. And uh, that treat is, is uh, Cave Falls. And uh, to be able to go right up to it and take some pictures and let your family and friends just take a look and enjoy the scenery is uh, pretty special. And when you get there, you can do a little hike so that you can actually get off the machine, hike down in there, go, go right down by the river, eat your lunch down by the river. It's just something really neat to do. You see the snow piled up on the rocks right out in the middle of the river, and you see uh, big ice chunks and, and things that you just don't see in the summer. It's just something really neat to see that you can't see anywhere else. With that falls coming over, it's just a soothing feeling. That water coming over the rocks, and especially go up in the cave, that's kind of neat. That's a neat feature that you don't see very often, uh, be able to look right at the waterfall. Well, it's just everything that you would picture in your mind of winter beauty. You see the icicles hanging off of the uh, rocks, and uh, the water's just going over the falls, and it's just, it's just absolutely gorgeous. As the snows of winter slowly melt away, the waterfalls of the Cascade Corner intensify. The roar of Cave Falls reverberates more loudly through the chasm, which witnesses its annual renewal. Spanning the entire breadth of the Falls River for 300 feet, this is the park's widest waterfall. It's also the only one in the Beckler area that you can drive to after the snows have cleared. <laughs> 